Hi there, today we'll be talking to singer and songwriter David Crowley. Hi there Dave. How are you doing? So could you tell us a little bit about your musical style and what genres appeal to you? And the genres that appeal to me most would be uh, folk, blues, uh, a bit of jazz, actually a bit of classical as well, and uh, um, funk especially. And are there any notable artists who have been an inspiration to you? Oh yeah, um, biggest would probably be Jeff Buckley, amazing singer, uh, John Martin, great folk player, great singer, Nick Drake, another amazing folk player, great singer, um, who else, um, yeah that'd be pretty, that would be Eddie Hazel, uh, funk guitarist for Funkadelic, amazing, that'd be, that'd be the biggest inspiration, yeah. And when was it you decided to start writing and uh, performing your own tracks? Uh, I was around 21 and uh, I don't know, it just kind of happened. One day I just picked up, I was playing guitar. I wasn't very serious at the time but I, I picked up guitar and I just started playing and started writing and I just, I don't know, I found a love for it and just kept going on from there and uh, I'm here. Mm -hmm. And uh, what's your usual process when it comes to writing music? Usual process? Um, I don't usually have the usual process, it's very mixed. But I'd say just sit down on the bed and I just whack away for a few hours and eventually I'll come up with something good. Uh, and could you give us an example of the kind of uh, gigs you play, or you have played? Um, I played a good few around Cork, uh, mostly open mics. I wouldn't call them gigs, but you know it's a good place to get feedback. Um, I've played in the Sexton, I've played... Uh, so a few other places, I've forgotten the names. And uh, one up in Wicklow, a festival up in Wicklow, which was probably the biggest one I played, which was pretty cool. And uh, would you be the type to get nervous in front of crowds? Yeah. Yeah? Big time. <laughs> yeah, I get very nervous before I go on. And, uh, it sorts itself out when you get on, when you start playing, it's, that disappears, you know. Uh, and what plans do you have for your music? Is it something that you would happily pursue as a career? Mm, I'd love to pursue it as a career, you know, I don't have a huge background in it, I don't have, my family isn't very musical, you know, I don't have, I don't know a whole lot of theory, you know, so it's kind of hard for me to get into college and progress onto that, but uh, it's something I want to do in my own time and to kind of sort out myself, you know, record myself and, you know, just take my time with it, yeah. Is there any advice you'd have for any uh, budding musicians? Mm. Um, anybody musicians? Take your time, have some patience, you know. If you think you've written something that you like, then go out and just show everyone, show everyone, show as many people as you can and try and get some constructive criticism. Well, you brought your guitar along with you today. Would you mind playing something for us? Yeah, no bother. Yep. I hope to Self-express and so Delirious, absolutely unequivocal smile I'll pull it down now. I shouldn't be sad And I should be mad Yes, I should be, I could be I really wouldn't want to be now that I've been had and I was fooled Oh, by your fool and that fool was you and Only fools understand the rules Of fooling one another Only fools can fool other they know the rules but I don't cause I'm no fool now so I go so I go so I go all the way down yes I show that I know 
by the way that you act like a clown I hope to alter my, alter my Self-expressed and so delirious Absolutely unequivocal smile Or pull me down <laughs> I've seen your dirty little trick book, but it's not as big as mine. My big black book of bullshit. That's right. I've seen your dirty little trick book, but it's not.